Hi, Gemini. What's up? Uh, this is Oplin Spiritual, another reading. This reading is going to be the mid-month for like the rest of September. So if you like what I do, subscribe, hit that like button and share my video. I really appreciate it. So right away, I was like Pisces. So you could be dealing with a Pisces. Something happened with a Pisces. I don't know. Something here with Pisces. Like you're like back and forth with a Pisces or something. So, all right, let's find out. What the hell is happening here? Chinese or the rat, Capricorn. Mm. Yeah, you're dealing with the Pisces here. And all of a sudden I'm hearing like, sounds like an argument or something. I don't know, outside my window's open. Okay, so here's your cup. Yeah, because I'm hearing, why so serious here? Hmm. Catching flies, I just heard. And the spiritual awakening. I'm literally seeing that you could be seeing a being in your dream that's going to be talking to you, but like with no words. It's very strange. Letter L. Chinese ear of the horse, cancer. There, There's like an alien here kind of thing. Like a large skull. It's connected to the brain and your head. Well, you are ruled by Mercury, but so this is very significant. Letter K, number three. And number nine, Chinese ear of the monkey. Virgo, Chinese year of the tiger, Pisces here, 30. There is a lock here and a crown. So maybe something that you really want, it's locked right now. It's not ready yet. It's connected to a tomb or a grave. Maybe it's not ready yet because it's something that's connected to the past, like a past life or something. Maybe in your past life you were royalty or you or you were something of a high thing. And maybe in this life you feel that, but you, you haven't made it there. Like you're supposed to be a leader, but you're not. Or maybe you feel like you're supposed to be something else, but you're not. Like you feel like you didn't make it there. But you were in, at, in your past life, you were, I'm seeing that. There's something with like the glutes, like the, the butt cheeks, you know what I mean? The buns, something with that. Maybe you're, they're, they're hurting or maybe you're accentuating something about that. Maybe you're working out with that. That's like a focal point for you. Or maybe you just like that part of the body. I don't know. <laughs> That's kind of weird. And then we have 65. Not weird for you, but like weird that I'm seeing that in the cup. <laughs> hey, butt cheeks are great. Like butt cheeks are, are fun. They're funny, right? They're great. So, um, yeah, let's move away from that because it's hilarious. And uh, we have Chinese ear of the dog here. So a friend, a great friend's coming into view here in the middle of the month. I, om I almost want to say the middle of the week. So this could be someone that literally, whenever you see this, it's the middle of the week that you're going to be with this person. Letter T, letter C, and letter M is here. And you have a, um, a target here. So a goal-oriented goal person is going to be important, or that's you. You're hitting your goal. You're hitting your target on something. O-S-E. 83. Chinese ear of the pig. Sagittarius. You have, you have a little smiley face here, so you're going to be happy. You're going to be very... Um, look at this big dragon. You're going to be really overwhelmed, but very powerful and strong through something. You could also be a leader or you're a manager or a boss of something. And I see you like doing very well for the rest of the month with that. Maybe earning some kind of, I'm hearing set income. And you have a door here. Look at this. Isn't this like very strange? A doorway for you opening up. So get ready for that. Brand new doors opening up for you. 
it's connected to your knowledge and expertise you earn this you definitely earn this and you and you're getting it you deserve it i'm hearing moon child here you have l love your heart's opening up to this and you're being shown the way and you manifested this look at this giant wand here look at this you're like the magician you earn this in two days two weeks Chinese air of the ox, Aquarius. Yeah, use your intuition to make beneficial changes in your life that are going to be coming up for you. You have the eagle spirit here. So something that you're going to be, it's like a triumph. It's something that you earned. It's a congratulations, like the seven of wands I'm getting, like a victory here. Wow, in the middle of the month. That's really cool. That's good. Yeah, de uh, you definitely feel like you're achieving something. I'm, I want to say Chinese ear of the dog, but I, I had that still that I had to think about. So maybe you could be all over the place, your head, trying to make decisions. Eight, Chinese ear of the goat, Leo. Scorpio is here as well. And then there's a mountain here. There's an obstacle. I see someone coming into your life that is going to help you overcome an obstacle here towards the middle of the month. Aries, Chinese year of the ox, Aquarius, 21. Letter L, letter E, Li. And I'm hearing, give me leeway. So maybe you're going to say, give me some space. Give me some, give me a break here. And look at this. This is like a brand new path at the end of the month. And it is connected to that Chinese year of the dog, that Scorpio person. Or maybe it's a Scorpio season. And they're saying, don't lose faith. They're saying, don't lose faith. Keep doing what you're doing. And for some reason, there's like a little sesame seed here. So that's significant because I don't even know how that would have ended up on there. So sesame seeds, there's a lot of them. Maybe this represents abundance. Maybe it's just going to take one thing for something to really blow up. Yeah, you have eight. The eighth could be significant. Or Chinese year of the goat, Leo. Or Leo season to start. You planted a seed, it's going to come true right now. Again, you have this Chinese year of the dog here. This is a loyal person in your life. This is someone that's going to bring you to the next level. And I'm hearing they could be temporary. So maybe just to help you get to this stage. Wow, this is weird. This is unexpected income out of the blue. And two things in your life, you need to wait. They're not ready yet. But this is unexpected income happening for you. Wow. I'm hearing slingshot. So that's all I have for you. Thank you so much. Comment down below. Let me know if this resonated with you. And uh, I will see you in the next one. Namaste. Love and light.